Hello everyone! Welcome to Math Corner. In this video, we will illustrate an arithmetic sequence. Let us begin. An arithmetic sequence is a sequence where the next term after the first is obtained by adding a constant number called common difference. Example of arithmetic sequence is 5, 9, 13, 17, and the pattern continues without end. These three dots, called ellipses, means the pattern continues without end. The first term of this arithmetic sequence is 5. Second term is 9. Third term is 13. And fourth term is equal to 17. Let us determine the fifth term of this arithmetic sequence. To determine the fifth term, we will add the common difference to the fourth term. To determine the common difference, we will subtract any two consecutive terms. The common difference is denoted by a small letter D. 9 minus 5 is equal to 4. 13 minus 9 is equal to 4. 17 minus 13 is also equal to 4. It means that the common difference is equal to 4. To determine the fifth term, or a sub 5, let us add 17 and 4. 17 plus 4 is equal to 21. And the fifth term is equal to 21. Next, let us determine whether each of the following sequences is arithmetic sequence or not. Sequence is arithmetic sequence if there is a common difference. To determine the common difference, let us subtract any two consecutive terms. In number 1, 8 minus 5 is equal to 3. 11 minus 8 is equal to 3. And 14 minus 11 is also equal to 3. Since there is a common difference, 5, 8, 11, 14 is arithmetic sequence. In number 2, we have negative 1, 6, 13, 20, and 27. 6 minus negative 1 is equal to 7. 13 minus 6 is equal to 7. 20 minus 13 is equal to 7. And 27 minus 20 is also equal to 7. Since there is a common difference, it is also an arithmetic sequence. In number 3, we have 8 minus 4 is equal to 4. 16 minus 8 is equal to 8. There is no common difference. It means that 4, 8, 16, 32 is not arithmetic sequence. Next example, in the arithmetic sequence, the first term is 10 and the common difference is 6. Let us write the first five terms of this arithmetic sequence. The first term, denoted by a sub 1, is equal to 10. To determine the second term, we will add the first term and the common difference. We have 10 plus 6 is equal to 16. And then, to determine the third term, we will add the common difference to the second term. 16 plus 6 is equal to 22. To determine a sub 4, we will add the common difference to a sub 3. 22 plus 6 is equal to 28. a sub 5 is equal to 34. And the first 5 terms are 10, 16, 22, 28, and 34. Next example, given the general term of the arithmetic sequence, a sub n equals 4n plus 5, let us determine the first four terms of this arithmetic sequence. To determine the first term, the value of n is equal to 1. a sub n is equal to 4n plus 5 becomes a sub 1 equals 4 times 1 plus 5. Since 4 times 1 is equal to 4, then we have 4 plus 5, which is equal to 9. 
and the first term is equal to 9. To determine the second term, the value of n is equal to 2. a sub 2 is equal to 4 times 2 plus 5. 4 times 2 is equal to 8. 8 plus 5 is equal to 13. To determine the third term, or a sub 3, the value of n is equal to 3. a sub 3 is equal to 4 times 3 plus 5. Since 4 times 3 is equal to 12, 12 plus 5 is equal to 17. To determine the fourth term, or a sub 4, the value of n is equal to 4. 4 times 4 plus 5. Since 4 times 4 is equal to 16, 16 plus 5 is equal to 21. And the first four terms are 9, 13, 17, and 21. And we are done illustrating arithmetic sequence. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching.